What is going on guys? Eric Bikeman here with another personal workout for you. This one is another full body workout. As many of you may know, I am on a five day, yes, right, five day full body split. Yes, I am incredibly sore because of that. And I'm trying to deliver to you more of my personal workouts just so you know what I do. Since I've been getting a lot of questions about what I do for my workouts, which I should start showing you guys some of my diet, but that's for another day. Well, anyways, let's get into the video. No more yapping. And also, if you do want to build muscle in our series about that goal, DM me my Instagram right here. Just hop into my DMs, okay? I'm okay with it this time. And DM me the word muscle. and We can work. So, let's get into the workout right now. This workout, I started with good old barbell bench press. And if you've seen the video, don't know if I shortened this part, I take more time in my setup than I have previously because of my shoulder injury. And this is a great exercise to hit the shoulders, chest, and triceps. And also this weight actually feels pretty heavy for me, but this was also like 2 a.m. I wanted to get to the gym when there wasn't really anyone there, so I wouldn't have any trouble filming. And this is a great exercise to really overload the chest on, so really hope you enjoy it. Next one I did is a unilateral one-arm row. I feel like I was going a little too fast with this. I could slow it down. I like this because my chest is supported. I don't have to rely on my lower back to carry some of the brunt of it. And also I can focus on one side at a time. Like I said, it's a unilateral row. And this is really good for adding some thickness to your back. And just overall great back, rear delt, bicep, and forearm workout. Now the next exercise we have is the dumbbell Romanian deadlift. And a lot of guys, they focus so much on their quads or the muscles you can see that the muscles in the back don't get so much love. So for me, I've always been naturally hamstring dominant. I always hit my hamstrings when I'm not hitting quads. And this is a great exercise to be hitting those. What you really need to make sure of is you're pushing your butt back and extending all the way through on the movement on each trip. Just stick your butt back. Now as many of you know, I have shoulder issues, so I don't really work my shoulders as much anymore, and I was just genetically blessed with really good shoulders. So they've never been really a key area of my body that I need to improve all that much, but I still do do shoulder presses just to help increase my bench press. And anyway, make sure you tap the dumbbell to your shoulder if you can. If you can't, don't worry about it. And if you can't do a dumbbell shoulder press and that doesn't work for you, just do a landmine press. That's what I'm doing more of and it's feeling so much better on my shoulders. Now we got dips. Dips tend to get a really bad rep out there for being bad for your shoulders. But if you ask me, as long as you keep your shoulder blades together, it should not be that bad for you. I'm keeping my posture more upright so that I hit my tricep more. And I've really only ever felt my tricep in this movement. It's one of my main tricep builders for the arm. Next up we have a dumbbell hammer curl. And this one is, oh, this was really hard towards the end. If you can see it on my face, I'm grimacing this because my biceps are burning at this point. And this is just a really good bicep workout or exercise to add into your full body routine. And we always end with arms because arms is one of the smallest muscle groups, so they don't need that much energy to hit really that hard. But I do hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, drop me one of these, drop me a like. Also, comment any videos you want to see in the future down below in the comments below. And also, subscribe for more content coming soon. And I'm very serious about this. If you really do want to build a dream body or a good body, head over to my Instagram right now and DM me muscle size. If you don't want to DM me, just go over to my Instagram and follow me. I'm always posting my workouts up there so you know exactly what I am doing. And if you don't have anything more to say, I'm just going to say peace out. Smash that like button. Comment anything you want to see down below in the comments below. And subscribe for more. And I'll see you badasses later.